Jesus explains who or what is the restrainer. Prophecy narrated by Daniel. All scripture references are KJV. Truly, my children, you must beware lest you be led away from the simplicity of the gospel. The moment some teaching becomes unclear, complicated, or causes doubt, you should recognize that this is not the Holy Spirit teaching. What you receive from me will minister faith, joy, hope, love, and praise, easy to be entreated, and simple to be understood. There are so many teachings suggesting or claiming knowledge of who or what is referred to as the restrainer in scripture, the power that withholds the Antichrist from being revealed in his time. It's so easy to know who is restraining the Antichrist from being revealed, for scripture proves that I am that restraining power, because all power is given to me, both in heaven and on earth. Satan is subject to my restraint. Therefore, the scripture can be understood this way. For the mystery of iniquity doth already work. Only he who now letteth will let, until he be taken out of the way. Understanding can be so simple when you allow the Holy Spirit to teach you all things. I want to give my children understanding through the spirit of wisdom and revelation. Therefore, know and understand that I am the one who restrains the Antichrist from being revealed until he is taken out of the way, when he is consumed with the brightness of my coming. Now I will make known another mystery, and of that which is to come. When the Antichrist is first revealed, it is Satan who shall give him his power, seat, and authority. He shall be the world leader of the new world order, whose coming is after the working of Satan, with all power and signs and lying wonders. Then, just prior to the beginning of the Great Tribulation, that begins in the midst of Daniel's 70th week, the last seven years before my return, the Antichrist shall receive a fatal wound to the head. At that time, Satan and his angels shall make war in heaven with Michael and his angels, but Satan shall be defeated and cast down to the earth with his third of the angels. Satan shall then be allowed to continue a short time, for forty-two months, the time of the great tribulation. And he shall have great wrath and shall make war with the saints, Christians who have the testimony of Jesus Christ. This is when he is allowed to possess the slain body of the world leader to become the Satan-possessed Antichrist, and he shall live, and all the world shall wonder after him. And now I have told you before it come to pass that when it come to pass, you might believe. In conclusion, 2 Thessalonians 2, 4-6 Who opposeth and exalteth himself above all that is called God, or that is worshipped, so that he, as God, sitteth in the temple of God, showing himself that he is God, the Antichrist. Remember ye not that when I was yet with you, I told you these things. And now ye know what withholdeth the power that restrains, that he, the Antichrist, might be revealed in his time, until he, the Antichrist, be taken out of the way with the brightness of his coming, Christ's coming. For those who are interested in End Times Prophecy, please visit endtimesofficial.com. That's endtimesofficial.com. Thank you and God bless.